Man, y'all know me, dog. Like, with these type of videos, I don't like to do, like, a, you know, fancy edit or anything. I like to keep it raw. And, you know, as you can see by the title, we are going to talk about music. And more specifically, we are, we are going to be talking about an artist called West Side Gun. Now, West Side Gun, dog, I got introduced to him, like, early last year, man. Uh, first album that, that I heard from him was uh, Pray for Paris. And if anybody is, you know, wants to get into West Side Gun, I say start with Pray for Paris. And then you'll get, like, a gist of, like, what, like, how he raps. What kind of beat, you know, he he chooses. Because let me tell you something, dog. West Side Gun, dude, the dude has an ear for beats, dog. Like, holy shit, dude. His beats, like, the, like, the ones that he picks out are fire, dude. And I mean, like, fire. So, yeah, uh, like, the whole reason why I got into West Side Gun was actually because of wrestling, dog. I'm not even gonna cap. You know, I, I never, I never seen an artist where... They like, you know, well, of course, we have artists like that, like anime, like, you know, like Denzel Curry. He referenced a lot of anime, even like nerdy stuff like Star Wars. Like, dog, the dude has a song called X Wing. And, you know, Logic, dude, I mean, Logic's like a huge geek, bro. Like, his, his, uh, the Incredible True Story is like a whole space album, dog. And this dude referenced, like, you know, Akira. Dragon Ball Z, you know, all that stuff. And, like, Little Uzi Vert, too. He, he has a car. I'm pretty sure he has, like, a Cowboy Bebop theme, like, you know, car. But, yeah, uh, West Side Gun, like, is probably one, if not the first rapper that I've heard and seen, you know, promoting what he loves. And that is wrestling. Like, dog, I'm not even gonna cap. He's the whole reason why I got back into wrestling. I started, well, I'm like, I think, I think you could watch wrestling on Peacock, like that, that streaming service or whatever. And I'm, I'm probably suggest, like, I'm like thinking of buying Peacock so I could watch WWE and, you know, enjoy, you know, the new generation. Because I recently went to a WWE uh, event called, I believe, Sunday Stunner. And I went not too long ago, like, well, like last month. Yeah, I want to say like last month I went to it. Yeah, like, around two months ago, last month, I went to, like, a WWE event, and it was a lot of fun, dog. I'm not even gonna lie. It was, like, surprisingly, like, very entertaining. I mean, of course, can, like, they have entertainment in their name, dog. And it, it, it was a lot of fun. And, dog, like, you know, West Side Gun, he referenced, like, a lot of, like, the old school, like, WC, I believe it's WCF or WC... I'm pretty sure it's WCF, if I'm not mistaken. But, you know, correct me if I'm wrong. But, yeah, he referenced, like, the old stuff. I think it was ECW, wasn't it? Something like that, dog. And he referenced, like, the old, like, the old school wrestling, dog. And then, you know, he referenced, like, you know, AEW. And, yeah, that's, the, and yeah, that's like, the whole reason why I got, like, you know, heavily into him. And then, you know, from Pray for Prayers, I started, you know, going backwards. Same with Logic. That's how I did it with Logic. I, you know, started from, like, his second album and then went backwards. And, you know, same goes to West Side Gun. I started from, well, I don't think it was his, yeah, it's not his second album. But, you know, I started from Pray for, Pray for Paris and started backwards. You know, and then I got introduced to the, uh, what's the HWH series, which I, I don't want to say the full name because I don't know if, I, like, this video will get taken down because if I say it. But, you know, it's something to do with the, with the World War II villain or not a villain but like yeah I, I guess you could call him a villain with the world war ii enemy we all know they do and start with an h or his last name starts with an h but yeah uh i i i got into that series very heavily dog the, his that series is so fire man it recently not too long ago he put out uh the the last series which was he named it 10 but it was you know hwh 10 but you know he named it just 10 because of like you know he's starting to get bigger and you know he doesn't want to lose like you know sponsorships and you know with the whole kanye west and you know jew thing that's i'm pretty sure that's why he named it 10 but yeah i got into into that series man whole series went through eight fire as hell and then i got into the fourth rope which oh my god dude that that album or mixtape what album or mixtape dog whatever you want to call it it's so good dude so many WWE ref references, not even WWE dog, like the old school stuff reference, you know, those are fire. And even like, dog, I I'm gonna say this a lot, dude, but his beat choice, man, his beat choice is so, so good, dude. Like, dog, let me, let me give you a couple of songs, dog. Hey, yo, my Like the keep it wrong. Nigga fell out one sniff. You can keep the stroke. 
slash on the two black crew next. Sure, suplex the guy. Hey, yo. Hey, yo. Rocky Stella sweaters. Truly weather, truly yours for pleasure. You left that nigga cause I fucked you better. Hey, yo. Pierre Marshall for the Mars breakfast. I'm gonna shoot them all first. Hand to hand crack call. So, yeah, man, those beats are crazy, dog. My god, dude. Like, I never been into, like, I know, I like, oh, I hella stuttered right there, dog. But, like, yo, dude, it's just like, I like, I get, I get too excited about talking about this shit because, dude, like, I love production, dude. I, if I'm more of a production guy than a lyric guy, dog, I don't get, dude, you could be talking about, like, dude's fucking in your ass or whatever. Like, huh? But if the beat is fucking nice, dude, I'm gonna I'm be like, oh yeah, dude, dude's fucking in my ass. Yeah, bro. Huh? Like, I'm gonna recite the lyrics, bro, because the beat will be so fucking nice. And I know, I know I shouldn't make, like, I know I shouldn't have, like, said that. Like, it just came off the top of my head. But, like, dog, if, if, if you're an artist that, like, knows how to pick beats, then, oh, bro, I, I... You know, I respect you for that, dog. Because, dude, Westside Gun, dude, his beats picking, bro, is so good, man. Again, I know I'm saying this a lot, but, dog, dude, I prefer, like, from the whole Griselda team, I prefer Westside Gun over anybody. I feel like someone that would come behind him. Huh? Or the, that, 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 that sounded kind of weird. But I feel like the runner-up for first place if West Side Go were to stop music, I feel like my my you know runner up would be uh Benny the Butcher, man. Can Benny the Butcher, man? Dude, look at it. Hear this song, dog. Yo, I've been selling dreams of sleepers, nigga. Tell the truth, that's the perfect business. Cause in the drought, I was paying double for some work that wasn't even worth the ticket. Play scrapers with the work to get it. Check my bank statements, probably hurt your feelings. Like, bro, dude, Alchemist did his shit in that fucking beat, dog. And Oh, bro, fucking Benny the Butcher went in, bro. His storytelling. Oh, my God. His storytelling, dog, in that song. So, oh, dude, I'm going to bust out a big word. So immaculate, dog. So perfect, dude. Because, oh, my God. It made me, like, dude, Benny, like, I know, like, this is a West Side Gun video. But, dude, like, Benny the Butcher, like, on that song, dog, it, like, it was so immersive to me when I, like, you know, had my earphones on. It was so immersive, dog, that it felt like I was cooking bricks, bro, with them, dog. That's how good fucking Benny the Butcher's storytelling is, dog. Like, holy shit, man, quit playing, dog. Grizzella team fucking fire, dog. I like Conway the Machine, but, dog, like, I don't know, I still have a, like, I haven't really got into him that yet. I haven't listened to his music fully yet. But, dog, uh, yeah, man, dude, like, I, I, but West Side Gun for me takes the cake, dog. He, like, he's number one for me personally he's probably in my top like 10 artists right now dog which is crazy dude like i have like i love a lot of artists but he's probably my in my he's not even like below he's probably like in the middle-ish area dog that's how good west side gun like you know has gotten so yeah guys that's pretty much it man check out his music dog i know this isn't like a good like professional video but that's not me dude i don't like making professional videos the only time i like making like good edited videos is when i do gaming videos and that's because you know you kind of have ha had to have like a formula or like a you know a good product for gaming videos or also like you know ain't nobody gonna watch it like if you just put raw like you know gameplay and you talking like you're not gonna get that you know i don't know it's hard to explain but you're not gonna get that many views you know not i don't i don't really care about views but you know it's not it's not gonna perform well but like videos like these dog dude like i'm not a music reviewer or anything i'm like the boy miami like that miami's a goat I, i'm like him dog i just want to like you know express my love for music dog because oh dude i i'm telling you bro go listen to west side gun project dude I, I kid you not dude you're not gonna be disappointed because i oh my god dude he's a coke rapper dog and there's nothing wrong with that i love i love me some coke rap dog i love you know Pusha t freddie gibbs you know benny the butcher all them dogs they, they're all fire dog but west side gun dog please give him a chance his voice might sound peculiar but please give him a chance and I swear to God, he will probably be in your top 10 rapper, dog. Not even a rapper, your top 10 artist, dog. But yeah, guys, that's pretty much it, man. And I'll see you guys in the next video.